An aspect unique to humans is their ability to transmit knowledge from one generation to the next and to continually build on this information to develop tools, scientific laws and other advances to pass on further. This accumulated knowledge can be tested to answer questions or make predictions about how the universe functions and has been very successful in advancing human ascendancy. Aristotle has been described as the first scientist and preceded the rise of scientific thought through the Hellenistic period. Other early advances in science came from the Han dynasty in China and during the Islamic Golden Age. The scientific revolution, near the end of the Renaissance, led to the emergence of modern science. A chain of events and influences led to the development of the scientific method. A process of observation and experimentation that is used to differentiate science from pseudoscience. An understanding of mathematics is unique to humans. Although other species of animals have some numerical cognition, all of science can be divided into three major branches. The formal sciences, e.g. logic and mathematics which are concerned with formal systems. The applied sciences, e.g. engineering, medicine, which are focused on practical applications. And the empirical sciences, which are based on empirical observation and are in turn divided into natural sciences, e.g. physics, chemistry, biology, and social sciences, e g. Psychology. Economics. Sociology. Philosophy is a field of study where humans seek to understand fundamental truths about themselves and the world in which they live. Philosophical inquiry has been a major feature in the development of humans' intellectual history. It has been described as the no man's land between definitive scientific knowledge and dogmatic religious teachings. Philosophy relies on reason and evidence. Unlike religion, but does not require the empirical observations and experiments provided by science. Major fields of philosophy include metaphysics, epistemology, logic, and axiology, which includes ethics and aesthetics.